Welcome to today our uh, lecture is about a success of differentiation or higher derivative sometime we will be given a question which is, would be about that find uh, second order derivative third order derivative or any that could be nth order derivative in that case uh, th that case uh, is basically called as a higher derivative or success of differentiation For, it is basically uh, that it is basically just like that is a first derivative or a first order derivative second derivative or second order derivative third derivative or third order derivative and uh, nth derivative and 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 can basically any number that can be three four five six one two three it can be any number it can be in thousand or any order derivative the representations of uh, it is uh, quite easy there um, it can be represented on uh, on many symbols uh, some of them are written uh, here the the first one is that uh, y dash y double dash y triple dash or y and n can be any uh, number or dash uh, for example it can be y y four dash y five dash y six dash it can be all also represented uh, represented as dy by dx uh, d square uh, y d, uh, by dx square d cube y uh, by dx cube d n y by d x n <coughs> Okay, it can be also represented as y1, y2, y3, or yn, uh, dy, d square y, d cube, uh, the y, uh, d and y. In this case, the y is written as small. It can be also represented it as like uh, f dash x, f double dash x, f triple dash x, and f n x. Okay, so uh, question on successive uh, differentiation or higher derivative is uh, that we would be given a question just like uh, given here f of x equal to 1 by 12 x x power 4 minus x uh, minus 1 by x uh, 1 by 6 x cube <coughs> plus 1 by 4 x square plus 2 x plus 7 the question would be that uh, find higher derivative of the of the given a uh, polynomial <coughs> okay so applying the uh, derivative um, f dash of x um, uh, and applying power rule uh, here the 4 comes uh, here uh, so, uh, subtracting uh, 1 from the power and uh, minus uh, 3 by 6 here the 3 comes from the power that comes down and 1 is subtracted from 3 which come which becomes 2 uh, plus uh, 2 by 4 2 here comes from the power to uh, 2 comes down and uh, 1 is subtracted from there and 2x uh, deriv applying derivative on that uh, it becomes a 2 um, uh, which becomes 2 and a 7 it becomes 0 because uh, as we know that derivative of a constant number is a 0 okay so uh, after that uh, cancelling the uh, if there are can uh, cancellations so we would cancel uh, and here are there for 1s are for 3s are 3 1s are 3 2s are 2 1s are and 2 2s are okay then applying second uh, derivative it becomes uh, 3 coming uh, down and 1 is subtracted from the power 2 comes down and 1 is subtracted and 1 by 2 x uh, 1 by 2 x uh, it becomes 1 over 2 again cancellation uh, here it can be uh, done so uh, 3 and 3 are cancelled 2 and 2 are cancelled and the question uh, uh, becomes that x square the solution that becomes x square minus x plus 1 by 2 again applying derivative which becomes 2x and uh, um, on x it becomes 1 and 1 by 2 is a constant number it becomes 0 so uh, the solution becomes 2x minus 1 and again applying derivative which becomes um, f f uh, dash 4 uh, basically there is 4 order derivative so we would write 4 dashes and it becomes 2 1 being a constant number it becomes 0 <coughs> okay if, if we if the here we have taken a four order derivative so the question is about take five order derivative so again we can take again also a fifth order derivative in that case the the solution will become zero because two is a constant number and applying a derivative on a constant it becomes uh, zero thank you for watching please subscribe